Hi, this is Chris at Condi Technical Support. Welcome to Condi TV. Today we're going to be talking about the SG400 printer and how to do a feed belt cleaning on it. The reason you want to do the feed belt cleaning on the SG400 printer, uh, you won't get any errors uh, on the printer itself, but you will start to get streaking or banding vertically along your paper, and that's from ink being built up on the feed belt as it's feeding through the printer. All right, the first thing we're going to need to do is get inside the printer so that we can find the feed belt and start the cleaning process. The products you're going to need for this cleaning is denatured alcohol and a lint-free rag. You can use a lint-free rag that you bought or you can cut up an old t-shirt like I used here. The first area you're going to work with is on the back of the printer. You're going to unlatch the two gray tabs and you're going to pull this down. And what we're looking for is this roller that runs across here in the back. You're going to use this to rotate the belt as you clean it. From there, you're going to open up the top of the printer, and this is where you're going to find the feed belt. You do want to be careful of these hoses here that run along from the cartridges to the print head, not to mess with those. And you also want to make sure your power is unplugged so you don't have any accidents. All right, when you get in here, you're going to find the feed belt, and you're going to do a nice wipe down to clean that belt off. You should see some black smudges or ink color on the uh, belt if it's built up. If not, you still want to clean that area anyways just in case it's very light. After you clean this portion of the feed belt, you'll need to put your thumbs on these rollers towards the back. Press firmly and rotate downwards. And continue cleaning until you clean the entire feed belt. Now that you've completed the feed belt cleaning process, close both covers, put the power back in and power your printer back up. You'll want to do a nozzle check just to make sure that that's still clean and then you'll be able to do a test print to make sure that all banding or streaking is gone. I'm Chris with Technical Support. Thank you for joining us. There are so many videos for you to watch, we don't want you to miss out on a single one. So click here to subscribe to Condi TV on our video channel. Click here to like us on Facebook so you don't miss out on anything. And click here to visit this product's webpage.